What's going on YouTube and welcome back to another abnormal video. Today we've got a pull workout for you guys. All you gotta do is follow along, try your best. Obviously some of the exercises are gonna be harder than others. So if you can't do an exercise, just think of an easier progression. And if not, just skip it, okay? Let's get these games for you. Hit that slide, run that show, that show, drop it down, strike that pose. That pose. Mother dance said, show me one two. one, two. Drop that show, that show, Kazu. Hit that slide, run that show, drop it down, strike that pose. That pose. Mother dance said, show me one two. one, two. Drop that show, that show, Kazu. I said, Kazu, 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 Show me Kazu, 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 Kazu. Alright guys, that was the warm-up. We're gonna go straight into the main workout now. We're gonna start off with statics, so we're gonna work on three sets each of the front and back levers, okay? Make sure that you keep your chest up right when you're doing the front lever and try and squeeze those abs. They said come true. Kazu, I said Kazu. Case wear down, now I got them moves. Drop that shoulder, style and move. Hit that pole, this how we do. Mana shut down anywhere we grew. Dance floor killers, we got them moves. Mana just flex on her and you. Drop your shoulder, show Kazu. I said Kazu, 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 Alright guys, so that was the front lever tuck. You wanna try and hold it for as long as you can. If that's too easy, you can extend the knees as I did. And if that's still too easy, you can either straddle the legs or keep them nice and straight and hold the front lever for as long as you can. You want to rest for around three to five minutes and then you go again for three sets of those. All right, once you've done those three sets, you're going to go into the back lever now. So you're going to start with the tuck. If that's too easy, again, bring the knees out. And if you can, do the full back lever and hold for as long as possible. Again, three minutes to five minutes rest between sets. I want to go for our three sets. Rest. Don't come around but you don't want stress Cross your sim, now I'm in a rep The Pia who back up, Pia around Mimpe I'm just really trying to live my best Hit that strike, I want two step Kazu, 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 Kazu Show me Kazu, 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 Kazu Just getting you on the max on all that hold Go as hard as you can just fire. Next up guys, we've got pull-ups. So we're gonna move off away from the statics and we're gonna do some sets and reps. So we've got pull-ups. Again, what you wanna make sure is that you retract before doing each rep and then pull yourself up. So it's gonna be a lot harder than regular pull-ups because we're gonna retract first and then pull up. All right, we're gonna go for 10. Chasing miracles, no, that's not how my story goes You could be my hero before I let you go Cause I don't go chasing fairy tales, no, that's not how my story goes I've been down this road before, I've seen the fall And now I'm falling So that was 10 reps I'm gonna rest for around 30 seconds to a minute, so a lot shorter now, and then we're gonna do another 10. So we've just done vertical pulls now, we're gonna move on to horizontal pulls. So different angles, trying to hit the back at different angles. We're gonna go for around 10 reps. Three, two. Next up, we've got explosive L-sit chin-ups. So we're gonna keep a supinate grip, like so. Pull as high as you can, all the way down. If you can, touch your waist. We're gonna go for around six reps. In three, two, one, let's go. Every time I've let you in, you've let me down. And the people who say that it's magical, no. That's just how the story goes Tell me if I let you in, will you be my fall? Ooh, those are the explosive l sit chin ups So obviously you just pull down as high as you can So all the way down Next up, again we're going to be hitting the back and biceps with this one We're going to go for head bangers So with head bangers, you want to make sure that your elbows are nice and parallel At all times, you don't want them to sink low And keep them up You're going to pull yourself out and then back in Okay, we're going to go for around 3-4 to four sets, 8 reps in three, two, one. 
Those are headbangers. I could have went for more reps, so if you feel like you can go for more reps, do so. The idea is you want to really feel it and push going to failure. All right, next up we got an exercise that's going to hit the biceps again. We're going to use a monkey bar for this. So what you're going to do is try and keep yourself in that parallel position as all times, and you're just going to come across the monkey bars like so. If you can, to make it hard as well, bring your legs up into an L sit whilst you're doing it. All right, we're going to go two times across. In three, two, one. Give yourself another 30 second rest and then go across again. Whew. All right, 30 seconds are up. I'm gonna go back and cross in three, two, one. Shit. Whew. Those are the monkey bar walks. Next up, we've got hammer pull-ups. So with those hammer pull-ups, you're gonna have a grip like so. Uh, if you can, find yourself a monkey bar. What you're gonna do is pull yourself all the way up in this position and back down. Again, different grip, hitting up, trying to hit the back, different angles. All right. I'm gonna go for three sets, eight reps. In three, two, one. Those are the hammer pull-ups. So next up, we've got tucked rows. For this exercise, you can either use parallel bars or you can just use a high pull-up bar. It's up to you. What you're gonna do for tucked rows is keep yourself nice and straight in a tucked position. Bring the bar all the way to your stomach and then back down, okay? So a really challenging exercise. Do as many as you can. We're gonna go for around four sets, six reps. All right, I'll show you what they look like. In three, two, one. So those are the tuck rows. If you don't have the strength to do that, because it uses a lot of core strength, all you can do is bring your knees back, like so, and pull in, like so. So make it a bit easier, and you'll be able to hit the reps. All right, guys, this will be the last final exercise. We've got body bicep curls. Right now, I'm pumped. I don't know how many reps I'm gonna squeeze out, but if you can, guys, go to failure. So we've got two sets of this, last finisher. I'll show you what it looks like. What you're gonna do is basically keep you again, arms nice and parallel. You're gonna try and bring the bar to your forehead. Okay, I'm gonna go to failure. Eight, three, two, one. <laughs> Form was ugly at the end. We gotta dig deep sometimes. And yeah, just push through the pain, boy. <sighs> Hope you guys enjoyed the back workout. If you liked it, share it with your friends. Smash that like button, and also subscribe to the YouTube channel. It's been your boy Ty from Above Normal Beings, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.